and I will now start by explaining special relativity to you in two sentences. Here we go. Number one. When you travel at really high speeds, time slows down. And when you travel at really high speeds, lengths become shorter. Are there any questions? <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> it is. Let me explain, because it sounds really hard. It sounds really safe. Let me explain it to you. For example, if there would be a rocket outside of this building, and I would walk out of the building, I would climb in the rocket, and then I would start flying at 290,000 kilometers per second, never achieved by humans, by the way, a speed close to the speed of light, I would start flying big circles around the sun. For the Scottish people, the sun is an orange <laughs> You've seen it on view cards from Spain. It's a bit of a bad joke with this weather, isn't it? We had sunny weather for the entire fringe, except for yesterday evening, but still. Sunny weather. I hear tourists are asking their money back. This is not why we came to Scotland. It's not. Our, our neighbours came to Scotland and they had sensational horror stories about the climate. And we want them to, and all we get is sunny weather. Because that's why you come to Scotland. It's, uh, it's Mulhausen by tourism. <laughs> we have five psychiatrists. <laughs> but like I said, I'm in the rocket, I'm travelling around the sun at 290,000 kilometres per second. And I do this for two years. I, I stay at the same speed for two years. Then I come back here and I land here. And I come in here, for me, two years have passed, and for you, 40 years have passed. Because time slows down when you travel at really high speeds. That is what would really happen if we could fly at this speed. Time slows down. It's not that when I walk around in my rocket, I feel like I'm walking in slow motion, because for me, it feels normal. Everything slows down around me. The laws of physics slow down. My brain activity slows down. Everything is normal for me. For me, you have sped up. So when I would look at you with a telescope, and you would wave at me, I would see you see a big cocaine bird waving. <laughs> when you could look at me, you would see me wave in slow motion. Time slows down when you travel at really high speeds. And lengths become shorter. So for example, if this rocket was maybe 12 meters long, and I would fly over this building at 290,000 kilometers per second, and you would measure the rocket the moment I'm right above the building, for you it would no longer be 12 meters long, it would be maybe 2 meters long. Because lengths become shorter when you travel at really high speeds. It's not that this rocket is crunched together. Again, for me, it feels normal. But for you, I would look like a squeezed photo. <coughs> Lengths become shorter when you travel at really high speeds. I can see headaches developing. <laughs> I know it's, it's, hard, it's hard to accept, but that's the way it is. It is. That, that's why I always say that space travel is the ideal Valentine's gift for your wife. <laughs> it's a good slimming technique. <laughs> she will age slower. You will. And you will get rid of her for 40 years. <laughs>